our top seven and seven tonight, a suspected robber is quickly caught. Good evening, I'm Allison Bologna. Dan has a night off. You see, the would-be robber's getaway car was not available. How come? He left the keys inside the store he robbed. NBC 10's Brian Crandall begins our countdown tonight with number seven in Providence. He got the cash but forgot his keys, and that's how police say Dino Salcetti was caught. On top of that, they claim his weapon of choice was an unusual one. According to the Providence Police Report, a would-be robber came into the 7-Eleven on Atwell's Avenue early Tuesday morning. The clerk said a man stuck a hard object in his back and demanded money. The clerk saw the object was wrapped in a white bag and decided to make a run for it. But the suspect didn't give up, chasing the clerk outside. Meanwhile, the clerk used his cell phone to call 911. Police say the suspect then went back into the convenience store and was able to get cash out of the registered drawer. But in his haste, he apparently forgot one important thing. When a police officer who was nearby showed up, the clerk pointed out the robber running down the street. The suspect was caught and identified as 39-year-old Dino Salcetti of Cranston. Police say he had $267 in his pocket. The clerk ID'd him as the crook. Police say a car registered to Salcetti's wife was parked in front of the store with jumper cables wrapped in a white bag. Remember, it was a white bag that the robber was holding to the clerk's back in the store. And the car was still parked because, well, investigators found its keys still on the 7-Eleven counter. According to police, the robber told them, I screwed up and forgot my car. He also said, I'm desperate, I just lost my job. I'm Brian Crandall, NBC 10 News in Providence.